Hey, it's your boy Celery Stick, and we're back. It's day four. We're with Woody. We're still sane somewhat. We're hungry, but we're not doing so bad. We got our fire pit set up, guys. Let's. We said last time we were gonna try to. Oopsie. We're gonna try to plant some of our berry bushes and sort of set up a base camp. Let's do that. And one thing we gotta watch is we don't have much wood around here, but I have a lot of wood with me. So let's do that. Let's plant our saplings. Oh man, what's nice about saplings is. I don't know when they did this, but you don't have to fertilize them anymore. They just start growing on their own, which is kind of cool. So we'll just put a bunch right down here. All right, we're done planting. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to make us a trap. How do we build a trap? To build a trap, we need th a lot more straw, okay? All right, one trap is better than no traps. And let's plant this guy. Right there. Right in between everything. Hopefully, there'll be a bunny that'll run into there at one point. Next thing, we got to plant all our pine cones. Okay, guys, it's dusk, it's day four, and I managed to plant about 41 pine cones. I should keep all the leaves off our backs, and you know what? We're doing pretty good. We're going to go toast up these berries. Hopefully, those will sustain us through the night because we're... Oh, some seeds, too. Nice, because we're not doing so good in the old hunger. Let's go and make us a fire real quick. Drop these off. One, two, three. Maybe a little bit more. Okay, who cares? Make it a rip-roaring fire. Oh, man. There we go. What I'm going to do is I'm also going to leave a bunch of wood here. I don't think I need to carry around, like, a few stacks of wood. We're going to toast these, or cook those and toast these. What do we got? 35. That'll be okay for the night. I don't know what we do with the honeycomb. I think that's for a bee box. I'm not going to walk around with that. We got a little bit of straw. I'm going to keep picking up the straw for now because we got some daylight. And this way, we'll be able to build us a campfire on our expedition that's coming up. What I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to keep harvesting, and I'll see you guys in the morning. Okay, so it's midnight. I'm sitting here around a campfire with my beatnik beard and my straw hat and my lumberjack. My lumberjack outfit there, and I really, really need a harmonica and maybe, maybe a banjo. All right, guys, and it's morning. Okay, so I've decided that I'm going to go in search of stone. We can always go and get us that manure down there. We know where it is, and we're not in a rush for it. So I'm going to go find us some stone, and I'll be back when I found it so you guys don't have to watch me adventuring. Ooh, berries. Some of the parts of this game that I really like, guys, is just the adventuring. I mean, I enjoy it. I think it doesn't make for good videos, but it makes for a lot of fun. And that's one thing that's nice about Don't Starve is there's a lot of replayability. Like, just look at the detailing on these characters. Like, look at us zoom in, and we just look at our, our real hillbilly beard and our straw hat that we found. Like, look at all these bunnies. Look at all these carrots. I think it's really cool. Let's just get some more food. Oh, come on, get the carrot. Oh, oh my gosh, we gotta eat this like now. Let's eat that too. And the seeds. Okay. Okay, we found a bridge to like another peninsula island. The food situation's a little grim. We're not doing so hot. But hey, that's okay. We'll find some more. Look at that. Right away, find a carrot. I know I should be cooking these, but I don't really uh, want to set up just yet. Maybe I'll, I'll wait it out. And we'll set up a little midnight base camp just to, uh, to sustain us through the night. So we found this swamp biome, so what we did is we went all the way up and explored through here, and it seems to all dead end, and we're going to come down and look through this swamp biome real quick. Hopefully at the end of it, there'll be like another savanna biome with a lot of stone. Aha! Uh -huh. We found some stone. And of course, I don't have my pickaxe wherever it went. Okay, well we'll just build one. And let's go mine up this stone. Oh, nice! There's a lot of stone laying around, too. Oh yeah, science machine, come to me. Alright, we got lucky. I like it when you can just find rocks like this. It makes the day a lot easier. <laughs> you know, the game isn't the same without Chester. I really want to find him again. He's a really cool little guy, that slobbering pumpkin. Okay, guys, we found another wormhole. Or, a, is it called a wormhole? Yeah, a wormhole. And we had found one sinkhole as well. We'll go back, put that on camera real quick. It's right over here. So, if I get really crazy, you can jump down in there. Um, what's really cool when you're the beaver is that you have night vision so you can go down there and it's not too dangerous. well it's still really dangerous but you're stronger because you got your 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 gnawing ability and uh i mean you're not going to die anyways when you're down there you always respawn at the mouth of the opening now i know that going through a swamp is probably the worst thing to do during the night um but we're just going to do it awesome oh, reeds oh you can never get enough reeds holy crap i should have never come through here oh man i don't want to be using my touchstone already this place is, like, really sinister. Like, look how menacing those spiders were and those mermhead guys. Oh, I'm starving. Okay, let's eat real quick. That'll hold us for a little bit. All right. Where are we? This is, like, the biggest swamp I've ever been in. All right. Everyone's off our tails. Nobody's around us. We'll put some fuel to this fire. 
And we'll cook up our carrots. I'm really glad we picked up all these carrots. There we go. Let's fill up that hunger bar. Let's fill up our health. We're doing pretty good. The one thing is around day five, six, I think the hounds start to come out. I'm not sure. And we still don't have a spear. So there's a few things we can do. We can plan to be at the beaver when the hounds come. Um, it's not too hard to induce the curse. But at the same time, it's kind of hard to recover from the curse. So I'm not sure. Oh yeah, now we just gotta get some gold and we can build us a science machine. Okay, we're back guys. All right, we managed to survive the night. I mean, just barely. Well, not really, but we just sort of hid there the whole night. There was nothing we could do. It's gotta be said though, a, a swamp biome is not a safe biome. It's really tough. All right, so we're gonna keep heading down. Hopefully we'll find some more stone and I mean like the gold vein type stone because we have enough stone for an alchemy or a science machine, but we need the gold now. Oh, big tentacle spike. But I really do like this game. It's so much fun. Oh, no. Oh, no. Run, run. Wow, that thing hit hard. That was like a trap that I fell for. Let's see over here. Anything? Awesome. Okay. What's really nice is this big old... Oh, wow. Look at that. All right. So we're down at the bottom. And this is like the... Oh, my gosh. The trees shouldn't fight back. Ha. <laughs> ha. Oh, he's such a hillbilly. I love it. All right. We got to watch it. I don't want to be attacked by any of these tentacles. Oh, my gosh. They're... We got pretty lucky. There's a lot of reeds here, although I have no use for them now. I know I'll need them later. Okay, guys, it's midday six, and all right, so I guess it's about noon, I suppose. I'm not sure, but what we did is we explored that entire little biome peninsula, and it's all a swamp. Um, I shouldn't say the entire thing. Clearly, we didn't do the center, but it's dangerous. It's too early for us to go in there. What was really cool is we found a lot of papyrus or reeds on the way in, and I collected all of them. So we got a lot of papyrus now. We got 13 cut reeds. I think it would be interesting if we went through this little sinkhole, uh, this this wormhole, this giant anus with the teeth. Um, I think it's a good idea. Let's just do it because right now I have no clue where there's some stone and it's really our only little bet. So let's just do it. Why not? Go. Yeah, it was gross down there. Think about what you were just inside. Oh, that was really handy. But I think we're on another island now. We're not too far away from where we were, but I'm pretty sure we're on another island. Let's, uh, what's calling to you? Oh, no. I think we're going to be turning into the beaver soon. Okay, let's make sure we got... We don't have much food, so let's pick up these berry bushes right now. What's really cool, when you are when you are that beaver, you're really strong too. So if uh, you have the opportunity, you should, you should attack some spider mounds. But don't attack like six at once, because you'll definitely get your butt kicked still. <laughs> All right, let's pick up these berries. Awesome. All right. Okay, that's where we came from. That's how we got to get back. Ah! All right, guys. Well, that wormhole was definitely worth it. Because as we're out, we found a gold vein. Hopefully with this guy, we'll be able to... Where's my pickaxe? Pickaxe? Okay, there it is. Let's go mine this up and we'll get our gold. So that was worth the sanity hit, guys. Oh, and two gold nuggets. Oh, man. Bling and bling. We're doing really good. All right, we'll collect up all these little chunks of flint and stone. And we'll be back in a minute, guys. Okay, we collected up all that stone. Oh, I found some more stone. We collected up almost all that stone. We're pretty crazy, but it's midday six and we're in pretty good shape now. We are truthfully in really good shape. We got our gold. All we got to do is head back to base camp and set up shop there. Um, you know, really, we could even set up shop here if we wanted to. I just don't want to waste the stone because it was hard enough to find stone in the first place. We're pretty far from home. We're all the way over. This is where we are. That's where the wormhole is. And base camp is right here. Hmm. Like, base camp is a pretty, pretty safe area. Maybe what we'll do is we'll just head straight down. Maybe they're connected and we just didn't know. All right, we're going to head straight down. All right, let's go exploring. Hey, now this is nice. We found some more stone, guys, and we actually found another gold vein, and we found another sinkhole. A plug stinkhole. Stinkhole or sinkhole? I think I'm saying stinkhole because I keep seeing anuses. I might just be getting confused. Okay. <laughs> A plug stinkhole. No, 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 no. Not yet. Oh, that was close. What's really nice is in the caves, we're going to be going splunking a lot in this series, guys. I really want to because I think they're new and a lot of us are a little too afraid to go down there. And I think, why not? Let's have some fun, right? Oh, yeah. We're in a good spot right now. Let's get some more gold. So, yeah, I really want to go down and explore those caves. And now that we have two sinkholes, we, we're in a pretty good situation. Let's get out of this graveyard. I don't want to be in here and go even more crazy, but that gold was worth it. All right, let's get this piece of stone. And there's more stone. All right, guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to mine this up. I'm going to set up camp for the night, and I'll see you guys in the morning, all right? See you in a bit. Hey, guys, and we're back. Okay, it's just like morning is broken on day seven, and I did some looking around. I did uh, manage to mine up all the resources in the area at night, 
And I did find one more gold nugget in the in the graveyard down here. We're going to go through there in a second. Um, it kind of looks like this area was attached, and I haven't explored it yet, but it looks like we just missed it. And that's what's really cool about these wormholes is it'll let you explore a lot quicker. So let's head down this way. What we're going to do is hopefully we'll make it back to base camp pretty quick. Oh, yeah. Okay. Where are we? I'm trying to find the path. Uh, oh, I can't say no to stone. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Our pickaxe broke last night. We're going to need a new one. Get to it. Come on, Woody. All right. Equip. Uh, equip. And let's go. I think, actually, the RPG HUD, I think before when you used to equip a craft an item, you automatically equipped, equipped it. But I think the RPG mod kind of got rid of that. I'm not sure. I don't actually remember. I could be wrong. So, you guys, I'm certain you guys will let me know if I'm wrong. Please let me know in the comments if that's the case. Um, we're a little hungry, I guess. So, what's really good to know is there's a lot of stone walls around here. So we can always come back and collect up. What the? Oh my gosh, they're attacking me. Am I that crazy? Holy shoot. Let's pick up the spear. Okay, run. Run, 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 run. Okay, you know what, guys? We're going to get out of here. I can't, uh, I can't hang out here right now. Do we have any food? No. Let's get somewhere. Oh, that probably made us more crazy. Oh boy. Okay, we are going to go right. <laughs> I've never been this crazy, ever. The apparitions are attacking us. They're manifesting. Let's just head back home. Let's get to our base camp. There should be some bunnies stuck inside those traps. And what we're going to do is we're going to go eat. We're going to leg it out of here. Oh, my gosh. We're in such bad shape now. Holy crap. Okay. Yeah, let's head right back to base camp. And I got a straw roll. So right there, we'll sleep, regain some of our sanity. And we know exactly where we can find some more stones. So it won't be a big deal. Oh, my. 21. Oh, my gosh. I've never been so crazy. Oh, wait. Take a flower. Yeah. And let's eat it. Oh my gosh. This is crazy. I don't know if anyone's ever played it like this. Like, I haven't. I'm certain others have, but I don't know if you guys have or not. I would have picked that. There's lots of flowers here. We should pick these up. Help with our sanity a bit. Our sanity is just crazy right now. Oh my gosh. Oh, a carrot. Awesome. We need that. All right. I don't think those things will attack us anymore. Oh, no, they'll still attack us. Oh, my gosh. Okay, leg it out of here. Come on. Let's get these carrots because we're going to go and we're going to use our straw roll. And we're going to be starving after. I want to go right back to base camp and do that. Oh, we're doing really good now. Oh, my gosh. That was crazy. I've never had those things attack me. I think the big problem there was, guys, we're in that, I guess, ruins biome. It's a ruins. Oh, this guy's chasing me still. Okay, where's home? Yeah, I think we're in the ruins biome. And that whole area was bringing down our sanity. Take the highway home. Ah, home sweet home. All right, so let's let's do ourselves a favor. Let's start a fire, cook up some carrots real quick. Where those carrots go? This thing is chasing me, and let's sleep right away. Oh my gosh, that was a bad move. Really amateur move by me. Okay, all right guys, I'm just gonna kite this guy around for a little bit, and what I'll do is when it's dusk, I'll go to bed and I'll wake up and I'll show you guys all that stuff. All right, see you in a bit. Oh my gosh, I can't even sleep. Oh my gosh. Okay, so it says it's too scary to sleep. Can I sleep now? My belly's too empty to fall asleep. Oh my gosh, I'm so gonna get owned. I can't believe I'm doing so bad. Okay, so like I said, playing as this Woody character has his advantages, but it's also really tricky. Let's try now. Oh, awesome. Okay, I'm just sleeping in this path in the middle of nowhere. We're gonna wake up starving. But these guys aren't gonna... Why are they still attacking me? Am I that crazy still? 68 he shouldn't be attacking me now okay let's eat this carrot all right we got to really do something about are these, these are still beardlings aren't they i can't even eat them oh my gosh okay let's put this in the fire let's cook these let's do that okay let's keep running away from this guy oh my gosh this is intense i have a feeling we're gonna end up turning into our our other character pretty soon so I'm gonna drop off half this flint and drop off my gold here my stone the reeds I guess night or two we'll hang on to these rocks I guess and some wood we'll pick up some more wood actually and we'll drop all right so I dropped everything right here they're just big piles all right I don't think he's gonna okay no now we're okay I don't think he's gonna attack us anymore no he's uh, no longer appearing as an apparition Guys, that was intense. Holy crap, that was really intense. Let's let's get this guy real quick. Oh my gosh. Right, let's pick up all our gear again. I thought I was going to have to hightail it out of there. 
Science machine. Let's do that right away. Right here. Oh, yeah. Come on, sanity. I thought after 80, these guys were no longer beardlings. Okay. I don't remember. Now, crockpot. Food. Food. Crockpot. Basic farm. Improved farm. Bee, bo bee box. Okay. Dry drying rack would be nice. Crockpot. Okay. We need cut stone. We got lots of stone. We can make the cut stone. We need twigs, which we have, and charcoal, which we don't have. Actually, do we have enough to make a, another trap? Yeah, let's make another trap and place it right here. All right, and these are bunnies again. Awesome. We're going to pick that up, put that there again. Awesome. Let's go and murder this guy right away. We need some charcoal. Okay, so to get charcoal, I got to make us a torch. And to make a torch, we can make one right now. Let's make it. All right, put it away. Yeah, you're peckish. Yeah, I don't have any food to give you. Relax. It's called living in the projects. Deal with it, okay? All right, let's pick this up. Let's pick that up. Is there some... All right, there's a small... We can burn this tree. Okay. I don't want to start, like, some giant forest fire. Burn. That should... I hate how you always take damage. Pretty much you always do. Okay. All right, that's not so bad, guys. You know, we, we could have... It could have been worse. All right. I'm not in that fire. Let's let these guys burn down, and we should get a fair amount of charcoal from this. Let's unequip our torch. All right. Let's equip our axe. Where's Lucy? Aw, oh, Lucy, I did miss you. Yeah, stupid tree. Aw, oh, Lucy, you're such a good axe. She's actually chops really fast, which is really nice. Let's get over here, chop this down. Nice. We did it. We did. Okay, what do we need to make a science machine? Oh, not a science. Uh, food's not even there. Okay, we gotta go back to the science machine. I'm pretty sure we're gonna need more charcoal than that, though. So let's light up these guys. I'm going to light up these guys and get some more charcoal, guys, and I'll see you in a little bit. Okay, so I lit up these trees, but I also found some manure. So I'm going to pick this up. Okay, guys, while we're out, we managed to find some manure. I collected, I think, how many? We got seven pieces. I think that's all right. That's a good start. We're going to head back home. We're going to pick up this charcoal before we go, and hopefully we'll make it back before it's right night time, because I can't really see right now. And we're back, guys. All right, we're going to set up our fire real quick. Let's, let's drop some fuel on the fire. Let's cook up these berries. We got us a fair amount of, of charcoal. We're going to toast all these seeds. Not all of them, though. I think we can actually build a farm plot now. Let's, let's see how we're doing. Let's leave, a, let's leave a couple seeds for ourselves. And we got a bunny over here. Let's go pick that up. Nice. And beardling? Oh, man. I'm still doing pretty bad. Basic farm. Improved farm. I can build an improved farm, too. What happened to the... Uh, Crockpot. Cut stone. I need three cut stone and two more twigs. We got lots of... He said there's something out there. I think we're going to be having an epic battle right now, guys. Perfect. We'll go back over here. We'll go to food. And we'll make our crockpot. Awesome. And we'll put that right here. Alright. Do we have any food to cook in our crockpot? Alright. We're moderately sane right now. Okay. We can put this in here. And that's it. That's all we have is one morsel. Okay. Okay. The food situation could be improved. I won't I won't deny this, but for now we'll just leave it in there. Um, we're gonna need to put some fire on this, our fuel on our fire. Okay. It definitely sounds like the hounds are on their way. Let's keep our distance from them. Until they're here, we're gonna Okay. Oh, I didn't know it was so close to morning. I wouldn't have wasted a board. I was about to build something. A farm, right? Food, advanced farm, or improved farm. Oh, I need an alchemy engine first. Alchemy engine. Cut stone and boards. Well, we can do that. Let's uh, let's continue to refine some boards. Yes, I know that they're coming. There's definitely something out there. I know, but I can't go crazy again. I'm too hungry for that. And cut stone. Perfect. How do you cut the stone when you're just like moving your axe around? Or spear around? Okay. So now, what was I, was I going to build? I don't remember. I was like, oh no, here they come. Okay. One. Okay, I remember how this works. They attack, and now we attack. Okay, run! Run! Oh my gosh! Okay, the, the fighting mechanic is no longer the way it used to be. Okay, come on, hack him! Okay, we got him pretty good. Oh! Are you serious? Oh, man! I'm so bad at games. Alright, since we're crazy, we're coming back as, uh, as our beavery friend. Okay, you don't want to eat everything, but like I said, when you're the beaver, I think that's exactly what happens. Every time you come back from a touchstone, you're the beaver. That's right. Let's 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 get up all these pig heads. 
I really didn't want to use our touchstone so quickly, but I mean, that's that's what it is. <laughs> Alright, let's grab up all this grass. Now, I don't remember where the touchstone was relative to our base camp. So, and I can't look at the map, which kind of sucks. But hey, we'll figure it out. Let's go. I think it's up this way. Oh yeah, what you can also do is attack some beefaloes, which is kind of nice. Let's do this real quick. Okay, we got one. Let's run. Hightail it out of there, bud. They'll give up. They'll give up pretty quick. Oh wow, that was the worst beaver run ever. Oh my gosh, I suck. <laughs> I don't know if they're so Run! No, yeah, they're still angry at us. Okay. Let's pick up this meat real quick. Go, 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 go. You know what? We're just going to have to go right back to base camp. These guys are too pissed. Where are we? Nope. Okay. Good. All right. So we're going to go back. We're going to get that meat real quick because that was some good meat. Let's pick it up. And some beefalo fur. Awesome. So when winter comes, we can actually build ourselves a, a decent supply there for our, our, winter, uh, our winter gear. Oh, yeah. That hound is definitely still there. Okay. If we can actually come over here and get our gear, we might be alright. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to beat this guy. Oh, I know what I'll do. I'll kite him over to the beefaloes. Nice. Okay. I don't get it. Why is it that there's always some kind of like epic battle for me? Why can't I just have a nice easy day? Like, I just got started. Why are these like... Come on. You guys are like natural... Bo oh, okay. I thought they were supposed to attack each other. Oh, I can't attack him. He's going to own me. I wonder if I can just outrun him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. We're almost dead. Okay. I'm pretty much dead. Okay. We're cooking up the meaty stew. We're going to collect all this stuff up real quick. Hopefully these guys don't harass us. Let's keep going. Come on. Pick up your gear. Okay, we got all our gear back on. We don't longer have... All right, meaty stew. Oh! Oh my gosh, we were so close to death. Okay, guys, you know what? I'm going to call it right there. I'm exhausted. That that killed me. I got to go take a nap or something. I'm so tired. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Please like, favorite, and subscribe. Please make sure to tell me all the things I did wrong and how I can beat these hounds because I was just two hounds and I just got owned. Let me know in the, in the comments, guys. I really do appreciate it, and I read every single one of them, and I'll respond to them too. Thanks again, and we'll see you next time, guys. Bye.